Hi, there's a couple of ways you can do this. I'm on the second floor here. I'm going to turn on the reference display. There's the stairs. You can trace over them with uh, 2, 2D CAD. It's kind of, it's not really that hard because you, with your snaps on, it'll snap to those lines. And perhaps it's a little, a little tedious. Now I'm going to turn the reference display off. See, I got that much done pretty quick. The hard part would be uh, drawing in the steps. As long as you don't worry about it have being perfect. Let's draw in a couple there for demonstration purposes. Uh, turn the reference display off. You get the idea. It's pretty straightforward. You can figure out <clears throat> the distance here on that one is uh, that. I'm just going to cop copy that value and then zoom back. And then uh, I'm going to just click on this line here and then hit multiple copy twice so I can copy paste this inner build that I got between, you know, there between the lines. And then with that set that way, finish it up. It's a little bit off. That's just one way to do it. <clears throat> now the other way, I'm going to just select those lines and delete them. The, another way, it's a little more convoluted. I'm going to click on the stairwell and copy it and then open a new plan and edit paste whole position. Whole position doesn't, doesn't matter in this case. There's the stairwell ob object. Now <clears throat> I'm going to take that and go to CAD CAD detail from view. And there's the CAD detail from view. A perfect, the perfect two-dimensional duplicate of the stairs. And I'm going to uh, marquee select this so I can block it. Now I'm going to copy that block, go back to my plan, and go to the second floor. I don't think paste hold position will work, but uh, let's just see what happens. Edit, paste, hold position. Oh, that went right, right into the right place. And that's just a two-dimensional two block. And if you want, you can take that block and... Uh, <clears throat> See, it's on, it's on CAD default. You can move this and change the CAD, uh, the layer name and so forth so it makes sense to you. But that's, that's the two ways uh, that I know of to do that. And uh, this is the one I use because it's a little bit more exact. This is an exact uh, duplicate of the original, but a two-dimensional du duplicate. Okay? Thanks for watching.